My name is Michelle Wright, and I'm currently an inmate at Two Rivers Correctional Institution in Oregon. I am a transgender female, and I'm 25 years old. Once I got a little bit older, after my father passed away, it became very apparent that I needed to open up about who I know myself to be. And I have been aware for quite some time that I am a female inside, but quite clearly my insides are not really matched to my ex exterior. And once I started to get my life a little bit together, um, I had a, a drastic issue or occurrence happen for me. I had been sexually assaulted by by a member of the community and it sent me down to a bad spiral and about a year after that is when I got this attempted robbery charge and I've been in the Department of Corrections for a little bit over three years. At the beginning of my time I was pretty afraid to pursue being transgender while I was incarcerated. Part of well, a large part of that fear is, is that I wouldn't receive any form of treatment for it, while at the same time, the, the hateful behavior that would follow me being who I am in here. Finally, it came to a point when I had completely stated that I can't not live as who I am anymore. I have to. Um, I have been threatened to not pursue it by staff, at which point, not too long after, I just decided to cut my arm and bleed out until I had been found unconscious. What would it mean to you to, to win this lawsuit?